Hi guys, I welcome you back to ACV channel. Without wasting much of our time, in today's video, we will talk about how to add motion, any motion into your motion puppet. So, as you can see, the reason why I'm bringing this tutorial again, because we've already this tutorial, maybe like last four or five months in iClosure, but the reason why I'm still doing this video right now is because religion has two words. Religion has changed the folder. So if you find as you as you already know that in iClose 7, if you want to add motion into this motion puppet, this area, let's assume I have my character selected here. If I load one of my character here, so the character has been loaded. And if I click on modify tab, then go to motion, you will see something here which is motion puppet. So the motion puppets allow you to hide any motion, which you can use what to mask out. So that is the advantage. You can mask out any character part that you don't want it to get affected when doing motion. This is very useful when you want to combine different motion together. So as you can see here. So if you want to mask out, I think you already know about motion puppets. As you can see. So that's the, if you don't know before, that's the advantage of motion movements. And I've already did video on that before. So this is the video. I will put the description in the video so that you can do what you can check it out, which is how to add any motion into high flow motion perpetuous. So make sure you watch it if you didn't know about it before. But if you already know it and you want to see that you can locate the folder in uh, I close it folder anymore. So the reason is that Relusia has changed the folder. So Relusia has changed the folder. You know before, let's assume uh, you want to add it into iClose 7, you have to go to local disk, users. So this is my iClose 7 here. This is where we normally had, uh, we normally had the motion prepared to. So as you can see, this is where we, we normally add it. So, as default, the only thing you got is this base, uh, I think it's base motion. So, this is my own customized one, and this is my own customized one. So, the one you get is base motion. If you check here, you see that it is base motion. So, you only get base motion. But, if you go to iClose templates folder, you see that that folder is not there. This uh, is this template, iClose 7 templates. If you check where. I close seven templates, then click on I clone. So you see that you see presets here. So this is where we normally had the motion into motion puppet before. But now that I clone has changed everything. So if you go to this I close templates folder, if I go to templates, as you can see, there is nothing here. So if you if you check animation folder, you don't see the idea. So it is not there at all. But if you want to locate it. And you want to add motion into this motion per side. As you can see, I've already my own, had my own motion here, which is based 3D. So this is my own motion that I had. So as you can see, this is my own customized motion. And this is the relation one. So if you don't know how to add motion into motion puppets, you can check my other video that I talked about earlier, this video. So you can check it out. So know how to add motion to motion puppets. But if you already know it, and you want to add it, into iClone, but you cannot find the folder in the iClone templates folder. So that is the reason why I'm still doing this video again for you to know which side you locate the folder. So, in order not to waste time, if you want to locate the iClone near iClone templates motion repairs folder, just go to your local disk, then go to program files, relution, scroll down to relution, click on it, iClone heads, program. Assets, high clone. Then this is where Relusia had the motion, the motion will pass for that too, this time around. So as you can see, it is under, it is under your local disk. So as you can see, local disk, program file, Relusia, high clone, programs, assets, high clone, motion puppets, motion puppets presents. If I click on this, you see that this is where uh, Relusia had the folder right now. So this is the bench motion. So if you, if you check here, the board, 
as you can see this is it so as you can see everything is here and this is my own motion that i had today so if i click on back back base 3d as you can see this is the base 3d folder here in motion puppet so this is it as you can see here this is what i had so that is how to do what how to locate your own uh, how to add motion puppets in high it that is the new way so relation the only the method is still the same so the method is still the same as i close it, but the only problem is that relation has changed the folder so relation has changed the targeted folder so they have added in under program files so which if you go to your local disk program file scroll down to relution click on it i close hit which is our uh, click on program click on assets high clone then you see motion puppet preset then you click on it then you find your motion so if you don't want to be adding new motion you can just kindly do what just quickly copy and paste your hold folder which is under iClone templates so if you go to if i go to under iClone 7 illusion here templates iClone 7 then go to presets so this uh this is what i have in iClone 7 but now that iClone 8 is out so you will want to do what you will also want to add motion in order for you to mask out some parts so can just do what you don't need to read to be rehearsed anything just do what just copy the folder copy and paste the folder so as you can see i only have base 3d and base motion here so if i click or uh, if i double if i copy and paste this base tutorial here so you see that you should also be there so let me copy and paste for you to see then click on continue so this folder is now under this motion puppet in iPlo8. So if I click this one, you see that it is not uh, popping up. So the base 3D is not popping up and it's supposed to pop up. So the only thing we have to do is that I have to restart the software right now. So I will restart the software. So now let me load another character, the character again. Character. So if I load one character here, so make sure your character is selected. If I go to modify tab, motion, motion puppets, you see that the base or uh, base tutor is now all those, it's now also there. So that is how to add your own. Uh, how to add your motion puppet folder into iClo8 and if you don't know how to add it before so because you have to solve from little step if you want to add new motion so kindly check the video as i said earlier kindly check this video out so i will put the link in the description below for you to see so check it out on how to add your own motion into motion puppets so that you can do what kindly mask out any part character part that you don't want to make it to affect so you can mask out any part and if you are uh, if you already have your own uh, motion puppet but you just want to copy the folder or you want to add new one so it's the same method so just follow this step that i told you about so that is it about now see you in the next one don't forget to subscribe share and like so in the next one we'll be talking about another topic see you bye for now